Hello, this is Palmer Mayor Steve Carrington taking you five days into the future for our September 26th, 2023 council meeting. Uh, the last week or two weeks has been rather busy with the Japanese delegates. The Saroma delegates have been here in Palmer for the last couple weeks. And uh, we'd, we'd sent some of our youth over in the summertime and basically they came, they sent some delegates over from Japan and many of those kids stayed in families in Japan and then the students that were in the same families came here and stayed with the families here. So there was already relationships built. It was quite interesting to see all the camaraderie and the friendships and the relationships built and uh, you know through this program. Uh, we also had a Matsu Valley planning for transportation meeting on September 19th. Uh, the manager and I went to that and we uh, went through some very, a lot of paperwork that had already been kind of prepped, et cetera, but that we were, were voted on by the official delegates and that I was now the official delegate for that. And Mayor Glenda Ledford from the city of Wasilla was elected president for that organization at this point. And I'm sure there'll be more to come. There's, it's still in the formation stages. So as far as a meeting, uh, highlight the meeting agenda. We've got a proclamation recognizing uh, Red Ribbon Week for October 23rd to 31. And then also there'll be a presentation from Palmer Police Department about um, their facilities and the needs of the facilities and uh, the uses. And the, it should be an interesting report from Chief Shelton on that. And then we have no less than seven action memoranda. The first is for a final design and construction administration services of HDL. Second authorizes the utility connection outside the Palmer City limits. Uh, that's because we have a Palmer City, a Palmer Water Sewer District that's much larger than Palmer City limits. So we're allowed to serve those areas outside, but we have to vote on it if it's outside the city limits. The third is for snow removal call-out services. The fourth is for snow removal hauling services. The fifth is for our new telephone system for City Hall. And the sixth is an airport lease agreement with Flying Gator LLC. The seventh is the construction of the temporary walls for weatherization at the Palmer Library. It's covered by insurance. And that's, we, uh, demo, we demolished the section that had the roof collapse. And so that's been taken out. And now we've got to build some walls to kind of uh, weatherize it for the winter. Uh, we still have some uh, equipment and materials in the old library that need to be uh, protected. And then for new business, we have a discussion for the residency requirement for the city manager. The deputy mayor asked that we bring that up and have a discussion about that. So, this has been Palmer Mayor Steve Carrington taking you five days into the future. This is the Hagen Park in Palmer. Dolphin side. The other side is a bike park. And this is some of the facilities, the new facilities that were installed at the Hagen Park, which is between Dolphin and Eagle. Our neighborhood park here.